We made it. It's really hot and it's also definitely gonna rain. Let's get started. Honestly, I've waited all day to start doing this. I'm kind of late. Normally, I would have been doing this the past couple days, but it's tomorrow morning. Oh well, let's go. This is everything I have. This pile here is stuff that I'm gonna hang up on the rack, stuff that's gonna have price tags, things like that. Over here is shoes. I already have them tagged from a market I did last month. And then I'm gonna try out doing a $10 pile. I have a bunch of things that, you know, they're just a little bit older. They don't quite fit the vibe of all this stuff but it'd still be nice to get rid of them and i'd probably get more out of it in a ten dollar bin than i would selling them at like a plato's closet type thing so a bunch of jeans shorts tops stuff like that that doesn't fit me anymore and then i also had like an old phone case that i still had the box for so i thought that would be like fine to put in there um a couple glasses i don't wear anymore this is a skirt it was a pair of cargo pants and I sewed it into a cargo skirt, but I didn't do the hems that well, so it's not the cleanest, and honestly, I did not get that much use out of it. So, $10 pile, we'll see. I honestly think I might sell more out of that than this stuff, but we'll see. I visited this market two months ago to kind of help me gauge how much I want to price the stuff that I have, so, We'll see, I don't know, it depends. It always is just like kind of up for grabs how much people are willing to pay for certain stuff. I think I'm only gonna bring one rack this time. Last time I did a rack of pants and a rack of tops. I think this time I'm just gonna mix it all in. I'm gonna throw all this stuff in the washer so that it's clean and everything is fresh. I'm gonna set up my rack. I got this one from Walmart, nine bucks, super cheap. Like if you're bringing a lot of stuff, like a ton, a ton of stuff, don't get a cheap rack. I use these tags from Walmart. They were like two bucks. Comes with a hundred, so that's a lot. I barely made a dent in it the last time I used them. So as far as supplies and everything go, it's super cheap to set up. The vendor fee is probably where you're gonna spend the most money. It can range anywhere from 45 to 350. Obviously this all has to be disassembled and everything before I bring it to the market. So when I put it in the car, it's all gonna be like broken down and the clothes are in pile. I keep them all already on the hangers. That way it's just easier to set up. I think one rack would definitely be enough because this whole rack was like full with tops last market. Um, and now it's not, which is a good thing. Yay. Okay, so pricing is up to you. Like I said, I went to the market beforehand to kind of check what people were selling and what they were pricing it at, so I knew kind of how to fit within that range. Okay, it's all set up. Everything's tagged, so that's easy. I don't have to do any arranging when I get there. I just pull up, take it out, put it on the rack, and I'm done. All the shoes, I just kind of set down there at the bottom. I put a bunch of paper towels in them to make them stand up. Kind of bootleg, but it works. Good morning. Today is the day. Don't look at my armpit because I have not shaved it. I need to fix the situation. I think I'm gonna stick my hair back because it's gonna be really hot and I sweat a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. So these bangs will not be banging by about an hour in. So we're gonna do some preventative measures, although I don't have a comb. So what can I use? Ta da! Oh, that actually worked perfectly fine. This my hair is on day two, day three, so she should slick pretty well. 
Pretty, pretty well. Am I giving a hair slicking ponytail tutorial in the middle of this? It's kind of what it's seeming like. Okay, fine. I mean, this is the crusty gel I use. Um, it's like over a year old, probably absolutely barely anything left in it. I have to smack the shit out of it, but it's still working. So I'm like, why buy a new one? Everything is still set up like how you saw it yesterday. I just have to put it in the car and then leave. We made it! It's really hot and it's also definitely gonna rain. The girlies go so hard. They have so much stuff and I don't have a lot of stuff, but it's fine. My little rack, so cute! Oh, and here's my sign sign. I literally made it for like 10 bucks and I put lipstick on and I kissed it all over to make it cute. I also don't have sandbags on my tent. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh god. Oh, this is not good. Not good. Now is the worst part because I have all of this stuff to take in and disassemble. I did pretty good, so I'm not mad that this part sucks. I'll talk about that. I just, I need to get this first. Sorry, just give me a second. 